Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to do a video about uh, my autographed baseballs. Um, I started picking them up, I obviously have the Nolan Ryan that's in my background, I've had that for a long time. But uh, recently I started picking up some autographed baseballs because my list of cards I want, um, I'm down to like five or six and they're all fairly big cards and I feel like they're pretty overpriced still. I'm not, I'm not sure I wanna spend that much on them with the chance of them potentially dropping in value. I'd rather wait it out a little bit. So in the meantime, I was thinking, what can I do with some of my uh, card budget? And I realized that autographed baseballs are actually pretty reasonable for the most part. I, I actually was quite surprised at uh, the types of deals you can get on those. So I started picking them up and uh, I want to do a video, kind of show them off since I've you know got, uh, I don't know, about a dozen or so now. So I wanted to show them off and uh, yeah, without further ado, let's check them out. All right, everybody, let's check out some balls. So this first one I'm gonna show, this actually is from my wife. This was my Father's Day present this year. So she picked me up a Joe DiMaggio ball. This is by far my favorite ball in my collection. This is, I love DiMaggio and it's really cool to have, uh, have his autograph ball. So let's start with the DiMaggio, obviously, the Nolan Ryan. You guys have been seeing that in pretty much every video I've done so far. So obviously got that one still, but these are all this, these new ones. Um, next up, got a Stan Musial. I was actually surprised at how inexpensive that one was for being, in my, my mind, one of the top 10 players of all time. It was a very reasonable signature. Next up, one of the most dominant pitchers ever, Bob Gibson. This next one, I would say top five pitcher of all time. You could tell from the beautiful signature, that's Greg Maddox. <laughs> Wonderful penmanship that he's got. Uh, next up, one of my favorite Yankees and one of my daughter's favorite players, you got Yogi Berra. This next one is my brother's favorite player of all time. He actually thinks that Ricky Anderson is the greatest baseball player who ever lived. Um, I told him I would agree that he's in the top 20 and he argues with me that he's the best, but got his ball because he is one of the greatest. Next up, I actually like this signature. It's hard to read, but uh, this is Ken Griffey Jr. The kid, that's a good one. One of the best of all time. Next up, Reggie. So that's a cool one. You got the Reggie Jackson ball. One of my one of my favorite players. One of the best Yankees of all time. Plus, just a generally cool guy. Watched his uh, his uh, documentary on Netflix. If you guys haven't seen, you should check it out. Next up, really cool signature on this one. It's Frank Robinson. <clears throat> Beautiful signature, it's a good ball. Again, one of the best of all time. I think most of these guys would make the list of some of the best of all time. I think if I, I'm working on my list, I know I've mentioned that uh, my goal for the year was to pick up the rookie cards of the top 50 players of all time. I'm pretty sure every single person whose ball I have makes my list of the top 50 of all time. This next one's kind of more towards the top of the, the bottom of the list, but Eddie Matthews. PSA DNA, all the rest of them are JSA, so that's why this one's got a slightly different, uh, slightly different setup. We got Mr. Cub, Ernie Banks, and then these last three, three of the best, all three of these guys make uh, make my top ten. Actually, I think all three of these guys are in my top five players of all time. So when I do, when I get all those rookie cards, I'm gonna do my countdown. All three of these guys make my top five. We have Teddy Ballgame, Mr. Ted Williams. Hank Aaron. In my mind, the true home run king still. And then this last one is debatable if he's the best all-around baseball player of all time, but uh, Mr. Willie Mays. 
So there you have it, guys. Those, that's my, it's my ball collection. I'll pull the Ryan out just because I've never really done that close up. So there's my Ryan ball. But uh, yeah, there you have it. There's my, my collection of autographed baseballs. Hope you guys enjoyed it. All right, guys. Well, I hope you liked that. Uh, that was a fun video to do. Um, and really enjoying picking up those autograph balls. That DiMaggio that my wife got me for Father's Day is awesome. It's by far my, my favorite ball that, that I've got for sure. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe. Talk to you later.